And hello everybody, welcome back to another Let's Play part of New Super Mario Bros. Weehee! So last week was only last, but we finished up the fourth world. And now we are going to start the fifth world. Yeah. It sounds like a total shock, because it is. So, how is everybody doing? Um, yeah. How's everybody doing? Um, today, if I'm not mistaken, is... June 5th. Not sure. Yeah, it probably is. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. So, if you go down here, you can get yourself the first coin. Yeah, today's June 5th, and actually, yesterday I was at a Tenacious D concert. Which was pretty awesome. Because, you know, Tenacious D's, you know. You cannot deny the awesomeness that is Daddy or. D -D -D or <laughs> you know what I mean. And my back really hurts because of that. Because, you know, um, there were people who, who were taller. They, they were standing in front of me. So I had to, you know, stand on my. Uh, I had to stand on. Blah, blah, stuff. Ooh, hello, 99 lives. I had to stand on my toes for the, almost the entire time. Or I had to straighten my back so I could see it properly. And yeah, so that's basically what happened. Is this, yeah, this is okay. Here's score number two. And let's move on. So yeah, that's basically what happened. Uh, yeah, my back right here is because of that. Because I had to stay, uh, stand straight for all of the time. Because actually, I'm a pretty tall guy. About 6 foot 20, if I'm saying that right. I just looked it up with measurements and everything. 6 foot 20. Or, what you want to know, about 189 centimeters. Not 98. Yeah, 98, not 80, 89, something different. 89 is 98. No, 89, I saying it right. I was saying it wrong here, here. No, 89. <laughs> I cannot make up my mind. So I'm I'm a pretty tall guy, but though, yeah, they're they were taller than me. <laughs> so it was kind of it was kind of a sad that they were taller, so I couldn't I could see the stage fine, but it, yeah. I had to stand on my toes and straighten my back the entire time. Which can be quite annoying at some times. And I was not such a smart idea. Well, if not that I can do about it right now. Just beat it, I guess. Just beat it. Haha, <laughs> you missed. It's funny because you missed. And stay over here. We go. There we go. And I don't know why. It was a smart idea to straight. That was awesome. How the hell am I supposed to get in there now? Also, I missed the third coin. Yep, I can I? No, I can't. Okay. See, can, I, can we get... Did not mean to do that. Can we uh, get the third coin from here? Definitely sure it's in, in there. Hopefully we can. Uh, is it in here? I'm not sure. I might have missed it. Uh, d d d d okay. And it's gonna be quite difficult if we want to get past this. No, we're not getting hurt. Like that. That did not go so well. No! I just rem Yeah, it was in there. I, I, I just figured. I remember. So I'll meet you back at the pipe at the end. So we'll see that. Okay, I'm back at the pipe right here. So I'm definitely sure it's in here. I just remember just not too long ago. I'm like, oh wait. Yeah, there's still a section after this. Right here. So, easy enough. Use password, boom. Everybody's dead. And jump up. And those guys still survive though. Hmm, coins. Mm, only quite a few actually. Let's just pick him up. Come on, you can do it, you can do it! Yeah! Oh, no, missed. Uh, hmm, oh well. Well, at least seems we only need 8 more coins until next to life. Which will bring our total to uh, 99 lives. Can we? Also, uh, fun fact if you spend those coins, you can sell some coins. So it's pretty, pretty nice to know, I guess. Yeah, we can get 99 lives for the end of this. So if we just spin these flowers. Get some more coins. And there we go, 99 lives at the end of this world. Oh, then again, we could have also, you know, went to the top of the flagpole. Uh, vines, I forgot. Just hold left and right, jump up and away. Oh, there we go. Now you're probably wondering, so what happens when you get 99 lives? Well, you get yourself a fun little easter egg. Oh, you will see it any second now. So when you have 99 lives, Mario will lose his hat. Like what? So what? What does that give you? Uh, well, absolutely nothing. But looks nice, I guess. 
Also, see those vines over there? Those will just spawn randomly. Yeah, we can make that. Ah ha ha ha! You miss. And again, I'm off of mushroom. Decision, decision, decisions, blah blah. Well, for now, we're gonna go to Wild Farm too. Is that guy over there? And that is Iggy Koopa. I just looked it up. That is Iggy Koopa. I'm missing it for the last four times now. That is Iggy Koopa. That is Iggy Koopa. This time it's for real. Oh, secret coin? Nope. Just power, just power lock. Boink. Also, we got some wiggles right here. If you jump on his head, he will get pissed off. So. Ooh, the combo. So, let's. Yeah, you don't want to do that. So, you can see Mario without a head. Like, what? He has hair? Nope, he's not bald after all. If you didn't know about that. Okay, you see Cormor there and the Wiggler. You see that? Ow. Oh. You see that purple stuff down there? That is instant death. So, what you want to do is jump and. Oh, jump up there. You see the giant Wigglers will see the encounter soon, so just stay in here and you'll be fine right here. And just move up. Is there something over here for interest? Nope, not here. Sometimes it can be secret up there, so you might want to look out for things like that. Bats? Bats? I see you right there. I know your bats crazy. Okay, well, this in the case you have to jump on a wiggler if you want to get past this. Which gave me trouble earlier. Uh, well, not earlier, that mean when I was younger. Well, this game is not really that old, it's like three years from actually now. Okay, a secret up here. Jump up here and just walk to the right. Ba da ba ba! Secret! And this will give us. This will give us. Not even. Not even proper English. Well, I've made a lot of words, but not proper English. Like dying a wolf, for instance. That is not proper English. I didn't know about that. So, and just leave those blocks be together. Let them be together. Best friends forever. <laughs> Inanimate objects, best friends forever. Bouncing on the wiggler. But okay. Now enough about that crazy shenanigans. Let's just move on ahead. Because we have progress to do. Oh, we have progress to make, there we go. So and we are. About nine minutes in, so we can do another left after that and then call it quits. So, giant wiggler, bounce! And top of the flag ball. There we go. No, it don't go more of the 99, so no, pretty much the top of the top of our game. I guess it's, you could say that Nintendo um, took their head off for you because you know we are so awesome at this game. Okay, you see, it's also a level down there, and you're probably wondering how the hell do we get down there? Well, we can't. See, it's stuck right here, unless, unless, huh? Oh, okay, wrong, wrong one. How do we? Unless, haha, okay, we cannot. Um, I wanna go through the level. I wanna go through the level. Okay. I'll meet you back at the beginning of World 5. I'll just go through World forward and then go back. So I'll see you back in a sec. Okay, we're back. It seems now we can actually proceed on to the next level. And before this vine thing just goes back and forward all the time, I'm just gonna do this level right now. Because the Martian Mouse can wait. That can wait. We still have to go through there though, but it, it can wait. You can see some more things, oh god, that one. You see those guys over there? You can jump on his head, or jump, uh, no. You can jump on his head in two ways. If you jump, you know, from the bottom, you get yourself some coins, or you can jump on his head, on his head, to, you know, kill it. That, either that, or... Oh, you don't have to look so sad about it. You know you're gonna, your life's gonna end soon, so you might as well deal with it. Okay, <laughs> that's a little bit harsh. And you can see the first corner right there in the corner. Uh, what do we have here? Um, I like this firefly, but the propeller mushroom could be nice as well, so let's see what I get. Well, since I got the propeller mushroom, um, hello, thank you, might as well keep this. It also makes it easier to jump through. Uh, jump, so. Can we actually spin jump and then kill him like that? I can't wait for this guy to come over here. Hey, 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 come over, get, get over here! Okay. That was close. Okay, see these locks over here? You just gotta keep on jumping. If you don't, you'll roll down to the bottom of these purple gooey stuff. And you'll die instantly. So let's not do that. So let's just stay here and be friends and stuff. Right through his forehead. 
My god, Mario's a violent guy, would you say so? And life! Life, life, get over here. Get over here, life! I wanna have a life, what? <laughs> See what I did there? It's like, hi, you gotta get a life. I'm like, there's one! Yay! Okay. Just move on ahead. Also, that concept right there, I saw a really, really funny t shirt. I don't know, um, who, the, who wears the who wear it or where it came from, but it was basically a picture of a um, paper daisy and a paper peach holding a mushroom, and it, and it said two girls, one up. <laughs> I thought it was pretty funny. But yeah. yeah, yeah, I thought it was funny. Um, if you don't know what I'm referencing to, you better not, you, you, you don't, you don't want to know. Let's just say you don't want to know. It contains graphic images, you wish you really do not want to see, no. Here's a guy, no, you don't want to see. Dude, dude, okay. You, Koopa, we need your shell so we can have progress. And progress is way too more important than your life. <laughs> Which is pretty um, harsh on it, I guess. Duh, that Koopa. You, hey, move. Move. Shelly, dude, dude, you, what are you doing? Okay, okay, now we can actually move on. Yeah. I was gonna. Doop. Right in midair. Shazam. Okay, okay, I'm just gonna stay here. I'm just gonna stay here. Oh, God, stay on. Stay on your feet. Stay on your feet, or stay on his feet, or jump on his feet. Okay, tricky right there. So, what you gotta do is jump right exactly before it hits the water. It might take you a few tries. Unless you have the propeller mushroom. Then it'll be much easier because you know you have the propeller mushroom. So you can easily spin your way out of there. Okay, then let me do that and go in there quickly because if you're too late, you'll find the purple gooey stuff of death and you'll die. And nobody loves the purple gooey stuff of death. Okay, give me a coin. Boink. Boink. Let's see how many coins he has. Six, seven, eight, nine. Unlimited supply of coins. Okay, about ten coins. That's nice, I guess. If you want to write coins, you can just hit this guy uh, in his chin, and he will spit out coins. It's kind of hard, would you say so? You just punch him in the chin, and you get coins. I'll give you money if you punch me in the chin. How convenient! It's not really convenient, but just you know what I mean. Okay, it seems we can actually not go to the mushroom house. So bad. Okay, so in the next part, we shall fight this walking piranha plant guy, and hopefully we'll get to the mushroom house. And after that. We shall face Iggy Koopa. So, thank you for watching. Wish you lovely and super sonic signing off. See you then and see you at the next part.